Governor of Abia State Alex Odi places 25 million naira bounty on killers of soldiers in Abia. In the wake of the tragic killings of five soldiers in Aba Abia State, the state governor Alex Oti has promised to give 25 million naira to anyone who can provide information leading to the arrest of the perpetrators. Oti made his announcement in a statement on his Twitter page while condemning the incident during his visit to the families of the fallen soldiers. We have announced a 25 million naira bounty on the heads of the criminals for anyone who can come up with any information that will lead to their apprehension. Otis stated. He also expressed condolences, saying to the wives of her fallen heroes, It is indeed a difficult moment, and we sympathize with you. Otis further condemned the act, stating, What happened is regrettable, and we cannot move on without identifying those who are responsible for this heinous crime and anyone remotely connected to it. The governor assured all that the state government will work with security agencies to ensure that the perpetrators are brought to justice. We are going to work with the security agencies to ensure that we bring the assailants to justice, he said. Oti also commended the commander of 14th Brigade, Ohafia Brigadier General Olushola Dia, for his role, stating, I also want to thank Brigadier General Olushola Dia, the commander of 14th Brigade, Ohafia, for heeding my call and de escalating the tension in Aba. The incident, which Oti described as an irresponsible and dastardly act committed by criminals, who do not want any good for society had drawn widespread condemnation from political figures. The governor, however, vowed that those responsible will face justice. Meanwhile, a medical doctor, Dr. Rose Agu, whose teenage brother was among those arrested by men of the Nigerian army in the aftermath of the recent killings of soldiers in Abia State, has decried the abuse he endured while in custody. No child should experience what my innocent teen brother experienced these past hours. He was slapped, beaten, and is still scared. His mental health will definitely need care for him to recover from this, Agu stated on Saturday via Twitter while confirming her brother's release. The doctor thanked well-wishers and authorities for their intervention, saying, I want to say a very big thank you to every well-meaning Nigerian who tweeted and shed light on the arrest of innocent civilians living around Obikabia Junction, Aba Abia State, which included my 15-year-old brother and my younger sister. Agu's brother and sister were among several civilians reportedly arrested by soldiers following the killing of five soldiers at an army checkpoint in Aba on Thursday. In her earlier plea for help on Friday, Agu had stated around 5 a.m. in the morning, the Nigerian army invaded my house, broke the gate and our door, and took my 15-year-old brother and my sister. Who had just come home away leaving only my aged father the incident came after five soldiers were killed at an army checkpoint in Aba area of the state on thursday following the attack the nigerian military vowed that the killers would not go scot-free